If you are encountering the wireless capability is turned off error message while browsing the internet on your Windows computer, then don't panic. In this video, I'll show you how to fix the wireless network capability is turned off issue. But before we start, make sure to hit the subscribe button. Method first, turn on your wireless option. Check if you have unintentionally turned the wireless off your keyboard. If you are using a laptop, then there is a function key that you can use to turn on wireless capability on your laptop's keyboard. It could be F12 or others. Just find the key with the wireless symbol on it. If you can't find the key with the wireless symbol or you are using a desktop, then you can turn on the wireless capability in the network connections window. Press Windows plus I to open settings. Then click on network and internet. Toggle on the Wi-Fi switch. Use network troubleshooter. Next, you can run the Windows network troubleshooter to identify and resolve this issue. Press Windows plus I to open settings. Click on Update and Security. Now from the left side of the screen, click on Troubleshoot. Then tap on Additional Troubleshoot. Here hit the Run button next to Network Adapter option and follow the on-screen instructions. Now restart your PC and see if the issue is resolved. Update Network Adapters Driver This issue could also occur due to outdated network drivers and to troubleshoot this issue, you can update your drivers. Press the Windows key plus X and click on Device Manager. Double-click on the Network Adapters option. Choose your wireless network adapter and right-click on it. Choose the Update Driver option. Click on Search automatically for drivers and follow the on-screen instructions. If you find manually updating drivers time-consuming, then you can use Advanced Driver Updater to update all the outdated drivers automatically. Download and install Advanced Driver Updater on your Windows computer. You can also use the link in the description. Once installed, open it and click on the Start Scan Now button. Now click on the Update All button to update all the outdated drivers at once. Once the process is complete, restart your PC. So that's it. If you found this video helpful, give it a big thumbs up and subscribe for more such helpful videos.